Wednesday, 16th November 2022, President Yuri Kaguta Museveni convened the Kampala leaders' meeting after just two weeks when he held the last meeting. <laughs> The meeting was attended by the Prime Minister of Uganda, Robin Anabanja, the Ministers of Kampala, City Executive Director, among other leaders. Top on the agenda was resolving the contained leadership market wrangles around Kampala Metropolitan. His Excellency the President, Yuri Kaguta Seven, has issued further directives on the management of government markets in Kampala in a meeting held yesterday at State House. Addressing media the first day, evening in Kampala, the ministers in charge of Kampala in the company of the city executive director, Dorothy Chisaka, shares the details of the engagements. The president directed as follows. One, market leadership in all public markets in Kampala is disbanded and should, with immediate effect, hand over the operations of the markets to the executive director, KCCA, to the executive of KCCA. KCCA will deploy staff at all government markets who will guide the market vendors on the immediate steps to be taken so that they can carry on their activities. Vendors shall pay periodic rental fees either monthly or annually. This will depend on cabinet information paper which are going to, to, to present on Monday. According to the resolutions, was the decision to mandate KCCA for the full management of public markets within Kampala Metropolitan. According to the directive, and as the press statement has been given by the minister, the leadership by the current interim committees that were placed there in 2021 should come back, is coming back to KCCA. We are going to have a process where they will, have, they will hand over to our task force on markets so that we can place the proper, the new leadership of KCCA in these places. That question concerning the, oh, Suzanne and the other people in quotes, just to tell them as, look at, see them as bracelets which were rent to them. Now the owner is claiming his bracelets, all so her bracelets, she should just hand over the, the hand, spread the hand, for the owner, KCC, to remove the bracelets, period. I don't President also redirected the city administrators to head to his earlier directive of setting up two public markets in five divisions of Kampala. KCC should establish, establish two markets per division as part of provision of workspaces for vendors and hawkers evicted from the streets. KCC, in collaboration with State House, should establish one skilling center per division for youth skilling and job creation. The yard at Tseka Market is strictly for vendors in mechanics, hardware, and not any other category of vendors. For Susan Kushaba, the former Owino Market, self-proclaimed supreme leader, the president's directive has however been distorted by the messengers, though she accepts that when the right time comes, she will step aside. But His Excellency said, we can work with KCC because there are problems that the, the vendors want to be solved which cannot be solved by KCC because KCC cannot recommend a vendor to get a loan but I have been recommending Susan Kushaba, who has been at the helm of the leadership of St. Balikudembe alias Wino Market is however convinced that if given an opportunity she is still willing to shift responsibility and I, I, I have an association we have a circle it has to run we have the youth circle it has to run so, but the administration will be for KCC. We want peace and order in all markets, all the skin, 16 markets. One sounding market, it might be a winner market, but all markets. The president is moved to streamline the 16 markets operation in Kampala Metropolitan. He is aimed at easing tension and creating better operating environment which has been sterile for quite some time and mainly arising from leadership gaps. Robert Nyango, UBC News.